and welcome to Seen Through Glass. Today I'm headed outside of London to meet up with my friend Philip Island. Now Phil picked up a brand new Audi R8 V10 Plus a few months ago and I begged him to do a video with it. However, he said, hold on Sam, wait, because he was getting a Lorini exhaust system fitted to the car. I think one of the first aftermarket systems for the new R8. So I said, I understand, I'm happy to hold tight until the car is perfect in your mind. Also, I obviously want to hear the new exhaust system. So today, after what feels like an incredibly long wait for me, I'm finally off to check out Phil's new R8. which was ridiculous and then when he was debating about buying the new R8 or the Huracan I went and met up with him and took his colleague Jude out or Jude took me out for a drive so he has appeared before but I haven't seen him since he's picked up this new car he has been trolling me with pictures of it because I think it's like nearly the dream spec on the new R8 it's black on black on black on black on black and now with this Lorene exhaust, I am so excited to check it out. So we have arrived and we are at Phil Island's office with his new Audi R8 V10 Plus. I am so jealous of this car. Mate, it looks insane. Thank you, Sam, thank you. I'm glad. Oh, sorry, Jude, it. by the way, hi. If you don't remember Jude, Jude works with Phil and has appeared in a couple of my videos before. I'll put the links below. Do you dare me to go talk to her? But anyway, let's not talk about Jude right now. We're talking about the R8. Mate, are you loving it? Are you happy? Uh, mate, I'm so happy with it, honest to God. Well, I bought, ordered it and then canceled the order. And then I remember, I yeah. remember the yeah, headache well, that said, you yeah. went through, I know. trying to decide between this mate, and a hurricane. hurricane. Yep. And I mean, I think you've made the right decision because this just looks so mean sat here on your forecourt. And the main reason you've made me, made me wait so long to come down here and check it out is you've now fitted, let's go around the back, the Lorini exhaust system on this car, which... Developed on this car. Developed on, developed this, developed car. on this car, So is this yeah. the first one with the... First one with the Lorini exhaust, oh, yeah. And you've it's started like... up just a couple of times to move it around here. Yeah. And it already sounds beastly, but you tell me that it is unreal once yeah, you open it, it up. it is absolutely incredible. I'm really so excited. I think there's nothing we should do but just jump in and go for a drive. That's exactly what we should do, Sam. Woohoo! <laughs> Bloody hell. <laughs> Bloody hell. I can tell that this thing is going to be a lunatic. Mate, and also, uh, it does need a drink. Oh, okay, that's fine. We can go and refuel wherever we need to we'll refuel. Refuel. I have seen more and more of these new R8s on the road, and I think I'm starting to like them more and more. I, yeah, oh, it's a same. difficult one. It's, it's one of those things, mate, because I'm, I'm exactly the same. Like, when it first came out, the pictures, I thought, I don't like that. I really don't like that. And then the more I see it, got this one, I love it. Yeah, yeah. Well, th this is probably, I was saying on the way here, as close to the spec as that I would choose. Yeah, that's it. And the other one, if you look at them side by side now, the other one looks really dated. Yeah. Right, so we're done. <laughs> Better warm her up. It's already sounding yeah. so good. And I was saying as well, when I first came down into my first video with you, yeah. we went in your old RAV 10 Plus, which also had a Lorini exhaust, exactly. and I yeah. literally was like, oh my god! Yeah. <laughs> I mean, you know when it's like when they the 430 to the 458, the difference was like night and day, and I thought, how far 
Ferrari going to better this? And they did with a 458. And this is exactly the same with the old one, the Gen 1, to this one. The difference is night and day. Oh, the soundtrack. Ooh. Here we go. <laughs> I just wanted to wave, it feels like it's waving. <laughs> So how much of your time do you actually spend? A lot of time. Yeah. Right? yeah a lot <laughs> Where of time. are we at so far? Is it expensive? Uh, it's not too bad. No? 95 max. I think. Okay. It sounds expensive to me. But. It is. <laughs> it's the bigger fuel tank, I think. Yeah, it's so, it's just this thing. It looks, sounds, and goes so well. Oh, what a beast. Try not to kill us yeah, while, this while is, you're playing around with it. Intergalactic sat wow. now, mate. We are going into space. Oh, 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 oh my god, that's insane. Great for the one ball that way. Oh yeah. But the thing which the R8 has always nailed is how usable it is. I know. So you look so because obviously you had the 458, or you still yeah. have the 458. Still, yeah, still got it. the 458. 43,000 miles. 43,000 miles. <laughs> yeah. It's been used. I, I buy it. How much is it? Yeah. Um, it's going up. Oh, damn it! I'm not gonna sell it just yet. I thought, I thought yeah. high mileage, like, mate, uh, I love and you 50, 50,000 pounds. But, but the headlining is so I'm nice. Back to the cross I know, yeah. You had this in your last I car, did. and it is. I'm oh, always gonna have it now. I love it. The but the thing is, the, the sports seats you can get in this quilt in the middle. Okay, so I guess the question is considering how much you debated between this and the Hurricane, yeah. are you pleased with your decision? 100%. So I've actually asked my client. Um, I've just done some enhancements to his brand new Hurricane to come along. That car oh, is actually broken, yeah. The, the white Hurricane that you sent me in the pictures? Yeah, yeah. So this is becoming, this video is now becoming, this RA versus Hurricane. Yeah, I think so. Who, care, the, who cares that you bought an RA? I know, we've got to make it special. We've got to make it special. We are going to find out if you made the right decision. Because right now, I think you did. <laughs> So wait, this is a client of yours, this car? It is, yeah, it is. He, but he, he said he'd kindly bring it down, he wanted to... Oh, I like the details on it, the, the matte black roof and stuff is really cool. Yeah, we've just done all that. Partial. Oh, this was you? You did the... You did yeah, yeah, the... we did the partial black black wrap. Oh, it's wicked. Lorini Club Sport as well, full detail and tints, window tints. Ooh. Okay, so this is literally the best and perfect comparison. Two Lorini cars, Huracan versus R8. Has Phil made the right decision? Yes, I think so. I think <laughs> Let's go so. find out. Let's go find out. Can you stop being so antisocial, please, Jude? I'm sorry. <laughs> You're taking over the driving seat? Of course. Oh, amazing. Right, I shall see you at the aerodrome. See you there. An 
actual drag strip. I literally thought, oh, maybe we're going to go and find some private road somewhere and do a little bit of illegal street racing. But no, we've come to a legitimate, uh, like, it's like an FIA sanctioned drag strip. It is so cool. And we are going to see who is quicker over, I guess, maybe it's a quarter of a mile. The Audi R8 V10 Plus versus the Lamborghini Huracan, both fitted with Lorini exhaust. This could be the... <laughs> this could easily be the moment that Phil either loves the fact that he bought the R8 over the Huracan or regrets it immensely. Not that 0 to 60 or quarter mile drag times are the reason you buy these cars, but they are nice bragging rights. This is going to be insane. <laughs> Well, Phil either jumped the star or got a better start. It's one or the other. It wasn't quite close enough on the start. These cars sound insane. But I think Phil cheated, so we might have to do that again. Everyone ready? Okay, so this is now attempt number three, and as you can see, I've jumped inside the Huracan. It turns out you're not allowed to have Lorini exhaust pipes on a closed drag strip. <laughs> We're officially being kicked off. So I'm whispering, I've got my exhaust as quiet as possible. We're getting out of here. Run away! We have found a picturesque pub to pull up at, which is probably a little bit safer than the drag strip that <laughs> we were being a little bit noisy at. Yeah. Mate, what a day. Thank you so much for arranging that madness. <laughs> but <laughs> it, was, it was better than I expected, to yeah. be honest. It was better than I expected. And it was so good to put your new car up against the Huracan, but the big question is, mm. are you happy? Are you still in love with your car? I, mate, I absolutely love it. I mean, to be honest, they're both I've got such a passion for both of them, but the R8 for me is just the everyday supercar. I know it hasn't got a Lamborghini badge, but... It fundamentally, for 50 grand less or whatever it exactly. is to a Huracan, yeah. I mean, I think you're winning at life. So congratulations Thank you very much, sir. on your new car. <laughs> I hope you guys have enjoyed it, and I will catch up with you guys very, very soon.